welcome to my channel. My name is Samantha and this is the Budget Mum UK. We are doing my uh, second week of Easter budgeting. So I've got a few things to plan over the Easter break and things I want to try and get done with Alexander. I need to do a big spend for um, Holly's room. I've been waiting to try and find a lot of free stuff. I haven't got it as yet. So I'm going to plan for it. But I'm going to spend the next sort of day or two desperately searching for free stuff on you know Facebook Marketplace and those free cycle places and things. But otherwise, I'm going to have to bite the bullet and actually buy a new bed, which I don't want to do. Um, yeah. yeah. Just because she breaks them. Like, <laughs> yeah. So, anyway. Right, that's what my plan. If so, try and find some nice things to do for not very much money for these to hold this with the kids. Um, I have got a new binder set up which I've still not filmed for you and I've still not finished sorting because, you know, children. I don't know, you know, I can watch all these fantastic YouTubers with toddlers and children and I'm thinking, how on earth do you do it? Because it takes me forever. I've got a three-year-old who likes to wear himself around my neck like a necklace or a mini shadow. And I've got a 15-year-old who has just started a job who needs taking them and back. It's like an hour there and back each time. I don't know how you do it, but hats off to you. You're amazing. Also, don't feel pressured into doing these things because, well, you'll know my, my child's really sporadic. I just film when I can. I'm just having one of those days today. We just feel very overwhelmed with everything. And so many jobs. I'm just looking around this house. <laughs> Strategically placed camera. Don't look that way or that way. We're okay. Um, I'm having a massive spring clean. And I'm also hunting for other things that have a loss in the house. I'm having a day. Send positive vibes and prayers from St. Anthony. Apparently I've been told by friends to pray to St. Anthony and my lost things will turn up. It's a new one on me, but why not? I'm willing to try anything right now. Right, let's get stuck in so I can crack on with this horrendous mess in my house. I should take a photo, it might make you feel better about your own. Uh, yeah, so I've got five minutes of peace while the baby's having to sleep. Holly's at work. Let's get this video done. So as always, we're going to have a look at April uh, calendar to see what I've got coming up. Uh, yeah, so Sunday we've got lunch. Need to make sure I've got some money going in to my envelope for Holly's bed. It's looking around the £300 mark. Um, I can't put... £300 in it today, but I'll, I can't remember what I put in now, actually. I'll have a look what I put in, see where we're up to. I managed to find some old bits of paint in the garage and stuff. I don't mind, I don't know what this can Does like paint expire? Like, it's got that oily thing on the top, but I'm reckoning if I give it a bit of a stir, it should be fine. Just some white top up. Anyway, um, so I might have a go at doing that as well. But yeah, this bed, I, I don't need a mattress, I just need bed frame but it needs to be a, a, a semi-decent one because the ones with the wooden slats they just break uh yes yeah, so that's that so the only other thing i've got coming up is I'm, i've got so much work to do over here so i'm not going to do anything i'm hoping to take alexander back to guy Statched hamlet which i mentioned the other week because they've got a big fun fair on and hopefully to the billy bob's play place and it wasn't a lot of money in, in the grand scheme of things um, I think it was about three pounds to play, three pounds for ice cream, so I call it six quid. And then if we got food, I could not, I mean, you're not supposed to, there are lots of signs saying do not take your own picnic to uh, guys that time. But I suppose if we had lunch before we left, played, called for ice cream on the way home, I wouldn't necessarily need to buy food, and then get home for um, a later dinner or something like that. That might work out, so I could save there, but I'm not sure how much the actual inflatables is. I'm gonna budget between five and 10 pounds. I'm hoping like, I don't remember it being a great deal of money last time I went, but it was a while when I went with Holly. Obviously she's a lot older now. So I'll just make sure there's some money there for that. However, I've also spotted on the RHS website near me at Bridgewater at Salford. You can get some deals on on a Tuesday. If you're a, a Salford resident, you get free access, by the way. You do have to prove your address or if you get certain benefits, or if you're going with someone with certain benefits, so I've, I need to double check it, but I think if I go with my mum and my dad, 
we can get in for a pound and they've got like a carrot thing on the Tuesday where you like plant your own carrots and they do it, we've got an egg hunt and everything else, even though like Easter Sunday's been and gone, but I'm thinking that might be a nice, cheapish, family friendly day to do. So I'll, I'll have a look at that and I'll, I'll put info on my Instagram and TikTok if I do that, um, about how much it costs and everything else. So yeah, but I did put some more money to one side for days out and things like that. So yeah. I think Holly's going to be working Saturday. She tells me she doesn't know about any other days at the moment. So other than that, I don't think it's going to be a massive, massive spend today. Petrol, I might know I'll need to do it because if I'm doing it, because I have done, I feel like I've done loads of driving at the moment. I do loads of driving, I'm trying to get her to work and back as well. Then I'll need to make sure I've got petrol cash ready for that. So that's where I'm going to be focusing my petrol. Maybe some days out type thing food but that's not too bad i think it was, was 14 pound for two courses I'm hoping they'll let alexander just eat off my plate because oh he has been eating loads or if they've got a kids menu maybe half the price so that's budget 30 40 quid for that say we'll have a look right that's gonna be most of my bulk then isn't it i think most of my money's going to right let's have a look at that then so i've already sort of gone ahead and filled it in let me have a look what's in my envelopes I've been really thinking a lot about my envelopes lately because of how, like I've seen a few other YouTubers recently budgeting in different ways and I'm like, actually that could work for me because I've got some things I want to start doing, 25 in there, so I need to put a bit in there. Um, so yeah, I like Holly's oh, doing fine. Alex is doing okay. So yeah, I might just like have a rejig of everything. Definitely some in there. Uh, let's get in a bit. Quiet, nothing needed in there. And grocery still got a tenner left from last week because I never went to get my eggs. Didn't get the eggs. Forgot to mention that. Um, but I do. Today's only Friday, so I could the reason I didn't get the eggs is because I saw an advert on Facebook or something like that saying that you can get these massive eggs for was it like one ninety nine or three nine? I don't know. They're like some like should have been ten pound eggs for so much. And when I looked in Tesco's, I was like, I don't want to pay that much. But I don't. I, I want to say Heaven Foods. Heaven Foods, maybe? I'm not sure. But I want to have a little bit of a mooch around either today tomorrow. We'll see. And I know I'm always pushing it when I leave it to the last minute. I know. I know. And that's always how I do it for Easter eggs. I don't know why. Easter eggs, advent calendars, always the same. I'm always that mum that goes in like midnight the day before everything's due to go out. I don't know why I do that. We plan for Christmas so meticulously. Come Easter, anything else like that? No. Anyways. So yeah, I need to I need to think about that. I need to have a look. I think I'm just reluctant to buy Easter eggs. I'd rather have a big bar of chocolate than an Easter egg, but that's just me. Right, let's do something then. Uh, let's not prioritise. Let's do eating out. He's about 30, I reckon. I'm not going to put anything in Holmes because she's got Lord in there. I might put 10 in Alex's. Beauty doesn't need anything. Petrol will, grocery will, tap it. Let's do... 10 in time for me, 34.50, put 50 back in the growth, that's 100, 20 in that and then 5, keeps going towards my gifts, yeah, if I get 5 I try and chuck it in my gifts one just because I quite like how that, how that works out, so I've got that right, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 120 there, Five left over, so that's, yeah, one, two, five. Okay. Let's get that stuff then. So one, two, five is what I've got. 20, 40, 60. Then 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. And five. Let's first of all go ahead and put five in my gifts envelope. We're up to May birthdays now, but some of these only got five in. So let's start off with that one there. And then we've got some going into my fluid envelopes. Eating out is getting 13, so we can cover us for Easter day. And then also ice creams and things throughout the uh, holiday. Nothing into Holly's, but 10 into Alex. 
petrol is getting 20. Time for me is getting 10. Beauty doesn't need anything and groceries should get the remaining 50. And that is us. All done. Right, and that is it. Hopefully, baby stays asleep long enough. I can edit this video and get it up for you at the right time rather than several days later, which has been my go-to recently. It's all good. Have an amazing day. I'm having an amazing day. I hope you do too. And I will see you really, really soon. Bye. So one, two, five is what I've got. 20, 40, 60. Then 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. And five. Let's first of all go ahead and put five in my gifts envelope. We're up to May birthdays now. But... Some of these only got five in, so let's start off with that one there. And then we've got some going into my fluid envelopes. And let's see. Eating out is getting 13, so we can cover us for Easter Day. And then also ice creams and things throughout the uh, holiday. Nothing into Holly's, but 10 into Alex. Petrol is getting 20. Time for me is getting 10. Beauty doesn't need anything and groceries should get the remaining. 50. And that is us all done.